I'm inside my enclosed trailer and I wanted to give you a closer look at a product that I picked up to mount my helmets when I transport my Honda Goldwing GL1800. It's called the Rackham Helmet Holders and I picked these up online. I got them at a good price and these helmet holders are designed to keep the motorcycle helmet stationary during transport. Now, I initially picked up these J-hooks for my E-Track rail system and they're great for sitting the helmets on the hooks when the enclosed trailer is stationary. But when you transport, the helmets are gonna flop around, it's gonna scratch the wall, it's subject to jump off and scratch the helmets. So I do not recommend using these J-hooks to transport your helmets. Instead, I prefer to use these Rackham motorcycle helmet holders that I picked up online. And I will include a link in the bottom of the description where you guys can get these. And these are designed to lock the helmet into place while you're transporting your helmets or while you're transporting your motorcycle. So stay tuned to this video and I'm gonna show you guys how to install these. There are several different ways that you can do it, but I'm gonna show you guys how I do it. Let's get started. several different ways that you can mount the Rackham helmet holders. If you notice it has a hook across the top, you can just take these hooks and mount them on wood and mount that wood to the wall like so. You could actually go across the top and find a place to mount it that way. But for my installation, I'm going to cut the hook off and I want to mount it flat against the wall. So since I'm working by myself, I'm going to be using my trusty jaw horse to hold the Rackham and I'm going to take my bandsaw and I'm going to cut the hook off the top of the rack. Now that I've made a clean cut with the metal, now I can sit it flat against the wall and I'm going to drill it to the subframe. I'm going to lock it into place. one more we're gonna get them drilled out and we're gonna attach them to the subframe of my enclosed trailer lock it down okay here we go I'm just using the weight of the bandsaw to make the cuts. I'm not forcing the bandsaw down through the metal. Just the weight alone is allowing the bandsaw to cut through 
the metal. Okay, I have the rackham secured to the jaw horse. I'm just gonna make mark a spot where I want to make my holes. Here we go. making a little template with some cardboard I want to line up. with the template that I made each rackham helmet holder will have the exact same mounting point subframe with my template and mount the rackham to the wall. I made the little uh, marks with the black marker. Now I can go ahead and drill exactly where I plan to put the self-tapping screws. see now that I have one of the Rackham helmet holders installed drill straight into the subframe don't have to worry about the hook or adding additional wood and having to paint the wood so I think it turned out real good I have two more remaining and we're gonna get those drilled into the subframe of my enclosed trailer
that's nice and secure that's not going anywhere Okay, as you can see, I have the Rackham helmet holders installed, mounted at three points on the subframe to the enclosed trailer. Now, I'm gonna show you how to mount the helmet to the Rackham helmet holder. So it doesn't matter if it's a modular helmet or an open face helmet, they all mount the same. Just slides over the top, like so. I'm gonna take the chin strap and go around this little flexible piece on the bottom just like you would uh, strapping it on your face. And you can cinch it up just like you would wearing the helmet to tighten it down. Okay, so just cinch it up. This piece is flexible so that it keeps the helmet from moving and just snap it on as you would normally. Mount up. And also it's got a place in the back where you can actually put your gloves or something like that. You can put those in the back and the little tray in the back. So I actually like this helmet holder. Uh, let's do one more helmet as a demonstration, do an open face helmet. For an open face helmet, the exact same concept. Sit it in. And it kind of takes a second to kind of get used to it. Put that strap directly on this flexible piece where it flexes up and you can cinch it down like so so that helmet isn't going anywhere you can actually snap it back down you guys enjoyed the video of me installing the Rackham helmet holders for the enclosed trailers. I will include a link in the description below where you guys can pick up the Rackham helmet holders if you want to install them in your enclosed trailers. If you like this video, be sure to hit the like button. And if you haven't already, subscribe to this YouTube channel. This is your boy Chris out in the Caliente enclosed trailers showing you how I install the Rackham helmet holders. And I will Talk to you guys later. See ya.